Hey everyone, and welcome back to The Sims Medieval. Here with Maggie and the uh, castle of Stoderia. But we want to try to convince the royal advisor to uh, waive the fee. So that means I have to be a little bit friendly with her, uh, him. And uh, let's, you know, chat and get to know him. Maybe we can be a little bit romantic with him, huh? Being friendly, quote unquote, with the royal advisor certainly has its advantages. But we will be very normal first. Also, we can ask him about music. Novel stuff, right? Let's see. He's agnostic. Hello, where are you going, man? He's going to the reception hall? Yeah, he's going to the reception hall. Here. Yeah, get to know him even more. I don't know the single thing about this guy. And then I need to eat. Cannot yet ask him for the fee. Let's woo him. Yeah, I have no idea if that's gonna be successful. He's friendly. Oh, you mean, you know, I mean if you can wave it seriously? Still not enough. Let's chat a little more. Cresic Walafim Quasal Winnab Sunibla and then get to know him again. Man, this is this is hard. Damn parrots. Well, now I can ask him about the feet. Which is good, that enhances uh, the relationship between those two. And then I have to eat. It's only one hour to do that. But my focus is developing good for a first level character. Right? And then I will try to brew a poison. Let's see how that goes. Alright, um, let's see what he said. Oh, I suppose we can waive the fee just this one time. Here's the deal. The person who turns in the biggest fish in the next few days will win the prize. Previous contests winners Fisherman Barney and Fisherman Marlin might be able to give useful advice, but be warned, one of them is an old eccentric and has been known to give dubious advice. I forgot which one. Oh, great. Uh, sorry. Oh, man. <laughs> Damn it. All right, so let's uh, first get some food because it's really about time. I have plenty of seeds, so... Uh, it's not a problem. <laughs> that has been done. And um, I'm good on the quest. Let me just collect these plants out here. Real quick. Since I'm already there, right? Oh, look at this. There's even another one that I haven't seen yet. Let's collect all of them. More seeds. And what we got here? Oh, another Valor root. Okay. And once this is done, you can actually go to bed. This is, by the way, a nice bed she has in her quarters. I just wanted to mention that once more. All right. Go to bed, Maggie. And then I will see you in the morning. The hubris will hopefully be gone by then, yeah, two hours, two hours. I might fall a little bit. Nope. Still fine. Good thing I have it comfy and decorated. That saves me the negative focus. So, she had a good night's sleep, apparently. Here, well rested. 
plus 25 focus for 10 hours. That's really good. I don't need to eat just yet. So let's grab this. Grab this and this. And this. Obviously. Nightshade is always important for poison. So I have some plants to cover. And then I should go to the docks when the quest is due. But it is not yet, so let's uh, start by collecting stuff. And when we're done, I want to craft something. Yeah, let's see that we get the spy a little poison in the pocket, right? That's important. Nightshade, grass weeds. I could do a vomishous venom. A rather weak poison, effective at irri uh, irritating stomachs. Okay, that's good. Sage word. I have no idea what that is. Well water. I could make a mystic rock. That's good. What does it do? Alright, so I don't have too many options just yet. But then again, she's a starting character. I will make a vomishous voice though. Just to have it done once. Uh, uh, uh. Shake, shake. Vim. Oh, that was a. Uh... Yeah, you've seen it, right? So she's got it. She's got the poison. I got some XP. Let's uh, write some secret documents. Since we're already here. What am I supposed to do? Pickpocketing. Okay. After drinking a feral elixir. Oh, I have a I have an elixir. Right. This is uh this is dangerous. She might have end up in the stocks. Yeah, I'm 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 tempted not to do this though. But well, let's let's uh Let's see first. So, are both targets close? Which one is that? Pickpocket traveling merchant. Traveling merchant. But where's the guildsman? Is that something I can't see? Uh. Difficult, difficult. Okay, she has failed to collect something. That's new. Then let's see if we can pickpocket this guy. I have not really high focus right now. So it, I might actually fail. If she ends up in the stocks, we will lose some focus, right? But I think that is... Is that a direct interaction? Bogani. <gasps> Oh. Uh. <laughs> Damn it! She's been caught! No! A stricter responsibility. At 9 a.m., all new opportunity to gain focus will be made available again. So, yeah, she failed on this one. And she got caught. No! <laughs> Marked for red. Damn it! Oh well. That's how it goes. So I'm losing a lot of focus. <sighs> and she's getting hungry as well. That might not have been the best choice. Yeah, let me let me see what's with the stocks. Um okay, so any hang on. Any sim uh, can I be rested, okay? Ordering someone to send, okay. Once someone being marked for arrest, the constable will seek them out and escort them to the judgment zone. There's no escaping the constable. Even if he's busy or if the stocks are full, his memory is fierce and he will collect marked sims eventually. Great. Sims that have been put in the stocks will have to remain in the stocks until they've served their sentence. Too bad, if you're hungry. Yeah. The spy might have some experience with a lock as well. Oh, I might be able to lockpick? No, I don't. 
Ah, okay. So I have some experience with being locked down. Well, I think the only thing we can do is... Um... Oh, and I can't even speed this up. Is that, is that all? Am I getting... Yeah. So he's setting her free now. That's good. Hubris. This is bad. And this is bad. I'm not sure. Six hours. All right. Oh, people. This was not good. <laughs> but okay. I mean, this is how the game goes. And it's better as in season one where I lost the knight character, right? Yeah, I'm not interested in what Martha has to say. Let's uh, make some good food. To prevent even further damage to the to the focus. I think we will remain in gold. That should work. Problem is, I have to pickpocket another guy today. Yep. So let's drink this potion. Let's see what happens. Alright, so... There's the guildsman. And I have to pickpocket... Spy. Yeah, that was... That might not have been the best call. <laughs> I might I might lose this again. Because I have a negative focus. It's going to be harder to actually succeed, right? Oh, she actually did it. Hang on. Hang on, hang on, hang on. So, managed to pickpocket 147 Simlons. It's not pocket science. Um, that's an achievement. I never got that one. So, gain 120 more or more in, uh, in one pickpocket. It's great. All right. Good. So, I, I got this one done, which is great. Um, I now have to hand over battle plans to the advisor. All right, I will do that. Which will give me, hopefully, some focus back. Job well done, I mean. She's still invisible. <laughs> That's actually pretty cool. That looks nice. Ah, she bet. What is? 215 synonyms and... XP. Uh, we're not too far away from level 2. And I'm back in the positives. Yep. What's this? Wow, it's odd to be able to see oneself through oneself. From eating and drinking. No focus effect, but it's still weird. <laughs> Alright. Um, quest, I'm falling behind on that. So it is, what, 4.30? That's okay. Let's go to the docks then. And figure out what's what. So there she is at the docks. I should talk to both fishermen and see what they have to say. All right, let's uh, let's see what they have to say. Let's ask this guy for advice and ask this guy for advice. Still a thorough. <laughs> Five more hours, huh? Oh, that's fine. So, how to catch the big fish? Classical fisherman's beard here. Oh, hey there. You want to help with the competition? Well, if you want my help, you cook me up an eel stew and I'll offer some advice that's bound to win the competition. Or Barney can catch anything in the water, but he don't cook that well. Just don't listen to the Marlon. He's a lying liar. Right? Let's see what he has to say. Oh, you want help winning the competition? Nice, if you go and seek out uh, an old salt like me. Now, if you want my help, just bring me an apple and we'll get started. And don't listen to Barney. He's a bit crazy. Ah, great. 
So I don't know whom to whom to follow. Not yet. So I will get an apple, certainly, and then I will get an eel stew. That means I need to catch an eel first, or buy one. I am not too bad on money, so I might actually, I might actually go and buy an eel, or I will just try to catch one. I mean, I have the possibility to fish over here, and over here. And here, yeah, there's plenty of spots where I can fish. It's just taking a ridiculous amount of time. Okay, let's speed it up. I'm going back to the positive focus. Now, all right, so what what I got? A herring, a trout. I got a swordfish, that's nice. And, of course, I got a uh, promotion to level 2. Slightly higher chance to pickpocket, which is great. Slightly more proficient at poison making. And can gather various herbs. Fighting proficiently increased. I can also have the rest full depth. Alright. So, another trout. If I don't catch an eel here, I will totally buy one. Swordfish... Tobot, no, no eel. Okay, so I will have to buy an eel. I can do that certainly here in the village shop. Let's go there. The thorough form is over. So back to the normal self it is. Oh, did you see that? I have to choose. Mm -hmm. So I can't buy an eel. Can I? There's an eel. I think someone... I, I really don't know the answer. Uh, but someone who is into fishing should be wanting to eat fish, right? So that's my... That's my idea right there. Oops. Let's collect this. And this. And... Barney was the guy with the eel, right? Yeah. Acquire a large a large eel stew. Oh, I might not... Ah, damn it. Yeah, okay. I might not have enough eel then. But uh, I won't be able to finish that today, so... Let's go to sleep. No, let's eat first. I have enough fish to make that. <laughs> I can do a swordfish soup. Uh-huh. See? What do I need for a large eel soup? There you go. I need an eel. I have one. I need cabbage, egg, and onion. Okay. Uh, I will buy that tomorrow. Uh, let's uh, make a herring soup. Yeah. You cook. And eat. Wow, 2 a.m. Let's go to sleep very soon. <laughs> yummy meal? Oh, that only... Fish soup only goes for yummy. Same as seed porridge. That's good to know. But I think it depends on the fish, right? I mean, salmon obviously gave us a huge focus last time. So let's hope I don't fail another activity here tomorrow. Oh god, really? All right, let's pray. Nope, I have to kiss someone. Great. Ugh. How much minus is that? Minus 20 on a permanent level if you don't kiss someone. I hate this. Oh. All right, so let's... Um, let's make sure we get an adventure then. And then I need to kiss someone. I think this royal advisor guy... Maggie, forgive me, but I think that's the guy we should be trying to be more friendly with. To get this done. And again, 
he's the royal advisor, so at least it cannot harm being very friendly with this guy. So okay, I got the I got the adventure buff. Which means plus twenty. So that that's basically neutralizing it. I should deliver vomitus vomicum, okay? And press three adults for information. That's interesting. But first, I need to get rid of this debuff. Ask him about his health. And then we... I will praise his looks and of course his virtues to make sure that he's really interested in romancing. Again, hang on. Th he thinks he's been flirty, which I think is true. Romantic. There we go. Um, then let's give him a romantic hug. That works perfectly. Gaze into his eyes. And then have their first kiss. I think that could actually work out with these two. And the debuff is gone. First Romans plus 40 focus, which is good for uh, the quest itself or for the, you know, but uh, I didn't want to Romans anyone just yet. Anyway, that's all I can do. Now, I have to... Oh, I already have the venomous thingy, so I can give it to this person. Yeah, but this conversation is over. Goodbye. Thank you for the kiss. Uh, that's all I needed. <laughs> Poor guy. All right, this has been done, and now I am to interrogate someone. Ooh, I am in to interrogate someone. We already have war that I can press him for war secrets. That's an interesting one. Where is this person? There. I'll wait though. So let's see if we can go here and press a couple of people for information. Wildflowers, Belladonna, Blood Moss, Valorood and Seeds. And I arrive at the marketplace to press information and no one is there. Look at this. They're all gone. It's a joke, right? Here we go. Press this person for information. Ah, oh, you talk right now, or I will cut your throat. Huh? That's pretty, <laughs> pretty aggressive. She really is. So I got one, two, and three. That's good. And then she's hungry again. Oh man. I have no idea how to interrogate the guilt guy. I'm not sure why this person is going away. Anyway, here. Try again. Alright, so I got uh, my second one. And now for the third one. This could be this person here. Let's follow Maggie a little bit around. Do, 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 do. I'm so harmless and a little woman and no one can actually do anything about me. <laughs> so, okay. so she's waiting until this conversation is over. Hubris again, but my focus is like crazy high right now. I need a blacksmith and a different weapon very soon. All right, so this has been done. Now I have to interrogate the guildsmen for war secrets. Oh, she's right over there. Oh, she is in my house. That is interesting. 
But how do I interrogate her? What do I need? I need an interrogation chair. Interesting. I don't have that just yet. So I think I need to build it. So this goes over here. This can go here. And then I need an interrogation chair. Where can I get one? Maybe I already have one. Nope. Does she have some... Does she have one in the... No, she doesn't. Alright, so I will have to buy one. I hope I can buy one. I'm not exactly rich with this person. Sort by function... Um, yeah, what is that? Comfort? I don't, I don't really think so, right? Dining chairs, living chairs, thrones. Let's check all. Nah. That's thrones. Bar stools. Uh-uh. That's benches and there's dining chairs. Wait a second. Didn't we have like magical, noble, military, elegant, rustic, upvillain, Tredonian, miscellaneous? Here? Huh. It's really difficult. I, I don't know, and I cannot really search for it, right? Um, this is too... This is too much to select from. Problem is, I don't really know what it belongs to. By function. Lighting, domestic, domestic, it might be domestic. Hygiene, entertainment, professional, here. Here we go, this looks a little more like it. Bart stage, questioning chair. There you go, I found it. Bam. Now I can interrogate her. And I will do it in this episode, just so we have it, right? Um, let's make it. Now, let's lock up a sim here. No more shit. <laughs> that worked. So she's finished. Oh, all right. I don't know. Um, wait a second. I need to. I need to read that up. Every action taken on a victim lowers their alertness. Be sure to finish the interrogation before the alertness runs out. Okay. I want to get. Bring to the top, to persuade. Bring to the bottom to interrogate. Be careful not to push into the red. So I want to get into the yellow area, right? All right. And what can I do? I can... Threatening. This is threatening. These two. Show the box. All right. Let's uh, start with, uh, with a classic. The chinchilla attack. Yes, we do have a chinchilla. Oh, this is evil. Chase 
seem to close it. Oh, shut it. Okay, so this went down now. I have to show the box. That should also send it down. I should have interrogated her, like, uh, yeah! sending this up. Oh, that, that went up. Okay, then let's tickle her. That's an interesting form of torture. <laughs> but that went down again. Why did this went down? I don't know. This is weird. Why did tickle go down the same way? What's happening with threatening? Is that going down as well? I haven't done that really, so this is a little bit difficult for me right now. I don't, I don't really know how that works. That went down as well. So sway. This is cool. I, I like the animations for this. And then went up. All right, so let's do the chinchilla attack. Let's do this, mm. and let's do this again. Okay. <laughs> Since I really don't know. And then do another chinchilla attack. I, I just want to see if I can. Yeah. See, the problem is the alertness is... is... And then I have to start over. Alright, so let's uh, show her the box. Then this. No. And then sway. I have to eat at some point. So let's uh, show the box again. I might, I might be able to do this actually. <laughs> so now can I, can I actually persuade? Yeah, that's another activity I can do then. So this is then hopefully the solution for this. And this takes a lot of time. <laughs> Alright, so I got a shot of a map tablet. I have no idea what that means. What I would like the end the tablet that was scattered. Hard to make out. Hmm, interesting. Alright. So what what now? No? That was not it. Oh, come on. That was not it. I need to read up on torture. And I will do that in between episodes. I think today's episode was already a little bit too long and unfortunately it did not give me what I wanted. Um this one here. I need to figure out how to torture people. Yep. That's an interesting read I will have over the weekend. So thank you everyone for watching. And to make Maggie more effective, I will read up on how to torture people. <laughs> See you next time. Until then, I'm Stodier. Bye.